Are there any famous Newfoundland dog actors? When it comes to famous dog actors, breeds like Golden Retrievers, German Shepherds, and Border Collies often come to mind. However, there is one breed that deserves more recognition for their incredible abilities in the entertainment industry, the Newfoundland Dog. Known for their size, strength, and gentle nature, these giant dogs have made their mark in various movies and TV shows. In this article, we will explore the world of famous Newfoundland dog actors and celebrate their unique talents. One of the most well-known Newfoundland dog actors is the beloved Nana from the stage play and novel, Peter Pan. Nana is the loyal nursemaid to the darling children and is portrayed as a giant Newfoundland dog in the original story written by J. M. Barry. Nana's character embodies the gentle and nurturing nature of this breed, making her the perfect choice for the role. She not only adds a touch of magic to the story, but also showcases the Newfoundland dog's ability to be a trusted and devoted companion. Moving on from literature to the silver screen, we find another famous Newfoundland dog actor, Beethoven. Beethoven is the star of the eponymous movie series that follows the adventures of a mischievous but lovable street. Bernard. While Beethoven is not a purebred Newfoundland, he possesses many traits similar to this breed, including their size, strength, and affectionate nature. The Beethoven movies became a hit in the 1990s, with audiences falling in love with the adorable and comedic antics of the titular character. Another notable Newfoundland dog actor is Smee, who can be seen in the Pirates of the Caribbean movie franchise. Smee is Captain Jack Sparrow's loyal sidekick and is portrayed by a Newfoundland named Gulliver. Smee's character showcases the Newfoundland's ability to be both fearless and gentle, supporting their reputation as wonderful family pets. Gulliver's performance as Smee received much praise and contributed to the success of the Pirates of the Caribbean films. In addition to these famous individual Newfoundland dog actors, this breed has also made appearances as a group in various movies. For example, in the 1992 film Beethoven, a group of Newfoundland dogs can be seen performing water rescues. This scene not only highlights the breed's innate swimming abilities, but also emphasizes their strong and protective instincts. It is worth mentioning that Newfoundland dogs have historically been used as water rescue dogs due to their strength and waterproof coat. Aside from movies and stage plays, Newfoundland dogs have also found success in the world of television. The hit Canadian TV show Due South features a Newfoundland dog named Diefenbaker as one of the main characters. Diefenbaker plays the role of Constable Benton Fraser's trusty sidekick, contributing to solving crimes and uncovering mysteries. Diefenbaker's character demonstrates the breed's intelligence, loyalty, and versatility, further solidifying the Newfoundland's reputation as a talented actor. In conclusion, while Golden Retrievers, German Shepherds, and Border Collies often steal the spotlight when it comes to famous dog actors, Newfoundland dogs have certainly made a name for themselves in the entertainment industry. From their portrayal of Nana and Peter Pan to their appearances as Beethoven and Smee, these gentle giants have captivated audiences worldwide. Whether it is their size, strength, or gentle nature, Newfoundland dogs continue to showcase their unique abilities on both the big and small screens. Hopefully, their contributions to the world of acting will continue to be recognized and celebrated in the years to come.